our blessed people, the Lord Jehovah has spoken with me today about uh, probably one hour and a half ago. The Lord Jehovah Elohim, Jehovah Sabaoth, Jehovah Ganan, Jehovah Imeku, Jehovah Hamelek, Jehovah Hoshea, Jehovah Hashofet, Jehovah Goel, Jehovah Adonai, he has spoken with me uh, this night. And it's a very, very urgent conversation, blessed people. And that's why I am coming to you at this time of the night, East African time. Not the other time zones are all right, but now East African time in the middle of the night. And in this conversation that the Lord Jehovah had with his two servants, the Lord has shown me a tremendous judgment of God coming upon the face of the earth. Today I am announcing a historic judgment of God Almighty coming to the earth. Today being the April 14th, 14th of April, the year 2021, at about 12.55 a.m. East African time, I am announcing a very horrific judgment, the most terrible judgment of God coming upon the face of the earth. I warned you, and I warned the nations, and I said that the coronavirus that I spoke is here, the judgment I spoke December 1, 2015, and I knew if the nations of the earth continue not to repent, not to pay attention, not to listen to the two messengers of the Lord, that the Lord would strike the earth with another most terrible judgment. So today, the Lord, in this tremendous dream, he asked, he asked me to step forward and to strike the earth with the horrific judgment of God, the most terrible judgment of the Lord Almighty. And in this dream, when I stepped forward and lifted up my left prophetic hand and my left prophetic finger and struck the earth, and then immediately I saw across the sky the rider of the pale horse running over the clouds. Again, just a few minutes ago, I have seen the rider upon the command of God when God commanded me to strike the earth with the judgment of Jehovah, the judgment of the Lord, the most horrific judgment of God Almighty. Then when I stepped forward and obeyed and did as the Lord commanded me and lifted up my left prophetic hand and lifted up my left prophetic finger and struck the earth, then immediately the Lord showed me in that dream the rider of the pale horse I saw him crossing the sky, across the sky right in front of me, and he was running through the clouds, running through the clouds. So I could not see the feet of the horse, but I could see him and the way he had saddled the horse, uh, the mouth of the horse, and running across the sky. And then after that, I saw the most horrific judgment of God strike the earth. First of all, where the Lord put me, so many mosquitoes came and started biting me there. You know, mosquitoes, they stand, those insects stand for the judgment of the Lord, the most horrific judgment of God Almighty. And when those mosquitoes began to bite me, a lot of them, uncontrollable number, then after that, I saw the most horrific earthquake hit the earth, and people were running in all directions. People were running in all directions. The humongous historic earthquake struck the earth. And people were running. And the earthquake was so dreadful, it was as though they are being struck from above. As though the earthquake was striking from above. As people were running and striking the land and things, people were running as they were being struck by this most horrific earthquake that is coming. I have seen the horrific judgment of God, the most terrible judgment of Jehovah, strike the earth. 
the Lord Almighty, he commanded his two prophets to step forward and strike the earth with the judgment of the Lord because they have refused to repent despite the fulfillment of the prophecy of the coronavirus, the prophecy of death. And when I did as the Lord commanded me, then right in front of me above in the sky, I saw the rider of the pale horse crossing the skies through the clouds. He showed me the rider of the pale horse crossing the cloud, crossing the sky, and racing. And then the most horrific infestation of a lot of mosquitoes, after which the most terrible earthquake struck and people were running. It was the most dreadful earthquake ever to see with your eyes how people were running and being struck, being struck uncontrollably. The judgment of God is coming. The Lord is asking the nations to repent and return to Jesus. Receive Jesus. Receive the gospel. Be born again and be holy. The Messiah is coming. The Messiah is coming. And the Lord is seeking the attention of all the nations because the Messiah is coming. I have seen the horrific, most terrible judgment of God strike the earth. It is coming. It's going to take place. And I saw buildings destroyed. I saw people running. And it was as though the earthquake was striking from above and striking the land as people were running. And it was striking as they were running. I saw people trying to run in the most fearful, the most dreadful way ever. The Lord is asking the church of Christ to repent, the present day church to repent and return to holiness. The present day church of Christ to repent, to repent and turn to holiness, return to the Lord and stop the sexual sin and stop the gospel of money the gospel of prosperity, the love of money. The Lord Almighty has already commanded the nations to repent and prepare the way for the glorious coming of the Messiah. Every single human being must now stop the idol worship, stop the immorality, stop the sexual sin, the homosexuality, the lesbianism, all the things that have defiled this generation and return to Jesus. Believe the gospel. Receive the Lord. The church of Christ must now become the light of Christ. They must turn away from the prosperity and the apostasy that has beclouded them, that has bedeviled them all this long. They must now return to holiness in the church of Christ. The church in the USA, church in Europe, church in Africa, church in Australia, church in New Zealand, church in Asia, church in Latin America, North America, everywhere globally. The church must now repent and turn away from sin, sexual sin, sexual lust, immorality, apostasy in the church. The Messiah is coming. The Messiah is coming. Christ Jesus of Nazareth, he is coming back. Repent. The Lord has just spoken with me a few minutes ago. This is a live conversation from Yahweh to the nations of the earth. Repent. Repent and turn away from sin. Receive the gospel. Return to holiness. Return to righteousness. Be holy. The Messiah is coming. And when all these things be fulfilled, then you shall know that the mouth of the Lord, he has spoken. Hasn't the Lord spoken with this generation? The Messiah is coming. Prepare ye the way of the Lord. Repent. Repent and turn away from sin. Repent and turn away from the love of money in the church. That the church may go out and evangelize the light of Jesus. The light of the gospel. Evangelize holiness. Christians must now return to holiness and righteousness. Time is over. I have seen the horrific judgment of God. I struck the nations of the earth with the coronavirus. And they have not yet repented. 
It is amazing. Repent. Repent. Repent and turn away from sin. Receive Jesus. Receive the gospel. Receive Jesus Christ as Lord and Savior, and you'll be saved. The Messiah is coming. Thank you.